Aloha and greetings, Seth Gambia here in beautiful sunny Kona, Hawaii, out for another edition of bear walking. And here we got our bear. Come on, bear, let's go. So anyway, just have to make a quick rant about something. Nancy Pelosi is just wrong. There's there's no two ways about it. She made headlines the last couple days by saying something to the effect of the U.S. doesn't have a spending problem. It'd be false to imply that the U.S. has a spending problem. And I just, I just, it just blows my mind that people actually think that, that she could actually say that and expect people to believe her. Guys, this isn't about Democrats and Republicans. This is about math. Math is neutral. Now, <laughs> we have a, an annual spending of about three and a half trillion dollars. We take in about two point one trillion dollars to maybe two point two. That means we're, we're in the negative one point two, one point three trillion dollars. So to say we don't have a spending problem, hang on bear, slow down. <laughs> and there's crew too. So to say we don't have a spending problem is kind of like, imagine this, imagine a family that takes in about $50,000 a year in income, but they spend about 100,000. They got maxed out credit cards everywhere. They got big screen TVs in every room. They got, they all have iPads and you know iPhones everywhere and every kid in the home. and. They go on vacations every month and they're just broke. They've maxed out all their credit cards and they're just flat out broke. And it's finally starting to dawn on them that they're broke. But then, but then someone says, hey, look, I just found another credit card that we haven't maxed out yet. Hey, it's all good. We're not broke yet. We don't have a spending problem. That's basically what Nancy Pelosi is saying. She's saying, look, as long as we can print more money, we don't have a spending problem. So it's just idiotic. So here's the thing, guys. Now I'm going to wrap up with this. Any politician who says that we don't have a spending problem is they're either an idiot themselves or else they think you're an idiot for and that you're going to believe them. So you, come on, bear. So make your own decision. Politicians that say we don't have a spending problem, they're either idiots or they think we're idiots and that we're going to believe them. So you decide. But it's just basic math, guys. My four-year-old up there knows that two plus two does not equal 14 trillion. Two plus two equals four. It always will, always will be. So that's it. all I got to say, guys. Be smart. Make good choices. Think about who you're electing and think about what they're telling you. And forget the party stuff and start thinking basic common sense and basic principles. All right, guys. I'm out of here. Have a great day. Seth Gamby, husband, dad, elevator, signing off from Kona.